Hey Wine Club, happy Saturday night. Just sitting here at the winery, uh, sun setting on Giant's Hut over there. Nate's doing some brewing. Wanted to do a little catch up uh, now, that, now that the snow's melted and hopefully you've received your wine. I think uh, Northwest Territories is the only place that uh, uh, hasn't received anything yet. And uh, you should know that the wine's on its way. Okay, I was originally planning to talk about the Roussan, which you guys received recently, but um, there are not a lot of bottles. I didn't want to open one, and I'm really excited about this new wine. So this is Pinot Noir Rosé 2018. Um, you can see, really nice color to it, a light extraction. The grape is Pinot Noir, so you have tried this with previous vintages of Pinot. And this is a really nice wine. It smells like honey, and it smells like flowers, it smells like licorice, it smells like strawberry, uh, taste-wise. Oh, it's so good. Um, again, same, same more natural style, which just means that there's no sugar in it, low in sulfur, no additives. Oh, it's just a really mouth-watering wine. It's really nice. Uh, so this is coming up in the next pack. Uh, other news from the winery would be um, there's also uh, Viognier Roussin in this pack as well, and I'll probably talk about it at a later point. I just wanted to mention this Pinot Noir here. And a question I've had um, quite a few times, actually, is how long can we age these wines for? So what I've done is I have a 2013 rosé that we're going to taste alongside the, the brand new Pinot Noir 2018 rosé. Move that over there. Put the glass. So wines actually, or at least these wines are never going to go bad. Um, but this 2013 is going to be a different wine than a fresh wine. So I'm going to pour this. So you can see the color as the wine ages, it goes into more of a rust kind of orange color. And, and as we taste it, it just means as it's older, it just becomes less interesting. So I really, on the nose, there's maybe one smell is pronounced, whereas when we stick our nose into this Pinot Noir, there's a lot more going on. And then as far as the tasting, Mm, it still tastes really good. The acid fades away a bit, but there's nothing wrong with um, there's nothing wrong with keeping your wines for a while. Um, I usually let you know when a wine should be drunk, and right now this 2000, 2013 should be drunk. But I wouldn't worry too much about that, just because as these wines age, they change, and that's what's beautiful about wines is the fact that they're they're living and they are changing, and that's. Um, that's really interesting about working with grapes is we get to we get to follow along with this process. So uh, signing out from uh, the industrial area again. Uh, this is a nice one coming your way. Wine Club exclusive 2018 rosé. Uh, in addition to some few a uh, few other ones. And yeah, and actually there's a really nice recipe we tried tonight too with some wheat berries. So we have a wheat berry salad coming up to pair with this as well, uh, which I think you're gonna love on your patio this spring with your new bottle of rosé. All right, have a nice night. Bye.